What is up everyone? Welcome back to the channel. Uh, today we're going to be hopping back into the best content that CG has available for us, which is uh, going to be Grand Arena. So <laughs> unfortunately we didn't get a whole lot of content yesterday. Uh, for those of you guys who maybe watch Arnold's stream, uh, I'm going to actually be doing a video a little bit later that I'll drop today on my reaction to the galactic ascension events but today we're going to go ahead or right now we're going to hop into uh grand arena and uh, go ahead and get uh that done before i run out of time uh one good news about today though i actually have an opponent that threw down a solid defense for me i was actually at work today uh kind of just figuring out uh what i'm gonna do uh to get through his uh defense with high banners but thankfully, right before I left, I noticed that he uh, he hopped in and did his attack, and uh, he got stuck on my night sister. So I've got room to play around, which also means uh, that I'm going to try out some new stuff. I did get Shock T unlocked for this go around. Uh, she's only level two, but I do have some pretty decent set of clones. So I'm thinking I'm going to try them out on this Phoenix squad, and then I'm thinking uh, I'll show you guys what he's got. So I'm thinking he's probably. Uh, in the section that's hiding, I think he's probably got Night Sisters there. Uh, so I want to save my Empire team for that. Uh, but uh, so he had solid bugs. He did not put them on defense. Uh, so I'm thinking he probably used his bugs to take out my bugs. Uh, he may have, well, we don't know if it's on defense or not yet. So we're going to test a uh, test out and see what's back there. Um, but it's not showing right now. He's got Bastila Jedi. He's got uh, Emperor Palpatine team. He's got Darth Sidious with the Zeta, which I haven't seen ever before I don't think yet in my Grand Arena so I'm not really sure uh, what that character is capable of and really not even sure what his Zeta is we'll kind of look and see if uh, we get to that point uh, he's got Shakti clones that are pretty decent uh, he actually has those set on defense for me uh, he's got a Padme team that he's got on defense uh, so he's got Thrawn unlocked uh, he's got Phoenix team so he's got some decent stuff for us to go through it looks like he's also got a Karth team he's going after Darth Revan uh, he's got a General Grievous uh, I don't know if he's got the whole stuff to make up a general grievous team but he's got him unlocked and at decent stars so got some fun stuff to do today so i'm pretty happy because my last few defenses that i've gone against haven't been all that great and this guy's got me padme he's got me shock t he's got a decent phoenix team and then maybe not sisters back here but who knows it could be that serious bugs team that he's got so um, i'm going to try to hold off my jedi for that section right there uh, to see what we get first so what I'm thinking right here, I'm going to try this team out. Uh, since we've got some room to play with, we just need to get the full clear to win. Um, I want to try out this Shakti clones team here and see if we can run through Phoenix squad. So my clones are okay. You know, they're only gear level eight, but they're all seven stars. Shakti, I just unlocked, got her to gear seven. Uh, so, but the leadership should be pretty solid for her. So. Uh, let's hop in and see how it goes. Hopefully we can get Ezra out quick and take their damage away and uh, try to stay alive. I don't have the Zeta on her, so there's not a whole lot of protection recovery or anything like that for me. All right, let's... Uh, this one... All right, let's go... here. All right, let's get more hits here. Yes! All right, let's wait and use that if we need a dispel. Let's see if we can push back some turn meter since we can't get counterattacked. It's he's at stealth. All right, and this one covers some stuff. So let's and throw this over here. Get a good hit in. Now we've got some taunts up. Let's get rid of those with the Dispel. Glad I saved that. And then let's go ahead and see if we can get... See if we can go after Zeb, because this is going to get rid of uh, his uh, protection recovery. Or their protection recovery. Alright, Zeb's out. Let's see if we can go ahead and get Chopper out. Cool. Not quite to a Rexalate yet. I don't think we're going to get to it. Uh, let's just throw this back over here. Get more banners back. Got him back to full health. So 59 banners. I'm pretty stoked about that. Like, that was a pretty good Phoenix team. Like, I think that they were all 
gear 10, gear 11 Phoenix teams that we just wiped out with a two-star shock T. Like, it makes you really realize, like, Phoenix is so good starting out because of all that protection and health recovery that they get uh, under Harris leadership. But, like, man, do they ever go out of favor fast. Like, that's uh, that's just not a very good team anymore. So, as I expected, I figured they would have a Night Sisters team back here. Uh, thankfully... Theirs is not as good as mine is, and I think that I'm uh, I'm not even really all that worried about undersizing right now. Uh, I kind of just want to be safe uh, just to get the full clear, so um, we're going to go Empire against this with Darth Nihilus. And we'll save Thrawn just in case we need him elsewhere. So let's... Uh, actually, let's do this. I want to leave Thrawn in. Because I think with what I've got left, I should be fine. Uh, I've got a Padme team that I can also throw in for cleanup to to get through anything that I maybe mess up on. Uh, so with this will take Zombie out of the equation uh, by having Thrawn in there. Because he's got the Zombie with the uh, revives and stuff. So uh, hopefully what we can do is uh, go ahead and get rid of that taunt kind of early. And then that way I can get over to some of his Night Sister stuff. So who's a weak one? We go after Talia first here just to uh, get through uh, some of this uh, revives that they're going to be having. Alright, let's just go ahead and get her out. Good deal. Alright, let's see if Culling Blade. Nope, it wasn't enough. Alright, so we got the two revives off the board. Let's go ahead and get Nihilus back. We can use that Annihilate if we need to. Let's get Daka out. We can. Alright. Dang it. So close. So now we're stuck behind this stupid taunt again. Alright, let's... Uh, I don't think that'll kill her, though. It did! Yes! Good deal. Alright, let's see if we can just fracture him. Uh, killed him. Alright, let's ability block her. Good deal. Some hits on here. Alright, some more stuns out, hopefully. Alright, let's throw this back to Nihilus. And just go ahead and get rid of Talzin. Oh, that's really good news, because that means she didn't even get to my health pool. Um, I do have some banners gone here and here. Actually, they did get the plague out. What am I thinking? I got plague all over me. All right, let's just go ahead and get them out as fast as possible, then. That's the thing about them, man. They are banner stealers, for sure. All right. 60 banners, though. I'm not sure how I got full health and protection, because I was pretty sure I was down on health. But I'll take it. All right. So, got some decent teams here, too. What I'm thinking here for Padme, I'm going to uh, split off my um, Bastila Jedi and set up a team there. And then for this one, I'm going to use these two. And I think I'm going to throw in Old Ben just for something to take damage. And uh, maybe... Let's just, I'm just going to be safe and throw in Chopper 2 just to have somebody else out there who, who can take damage off of my uh, Jedi here. Not, like I said, I'm not super worried about banners. I'm just worried about getting a full clear since he didn't, wasn't able to clear my stuff. All right. Let's go after Shock T and get her out. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and hit her with the big one. Good deal. Now this team is far less dangerous without her there. So, but I mean, they're still, I don't know why I did that. All right, let's go ahead and uh, let's get the taunt up here. And then let's just go after Rex and get him out. Alright, we're stuck behind the taunt. Let's go ahead and throw Foresight up. 
go ahead. Get Yoda moving. All right, just to be safe, get him out. All right, let's just hit him with the dab there. Go after Rex. All right, let's go ahead and get Echo out. Do that action there. And I don't think I necessarily can get this back. Oh yeah, here we go. Uh, this doesn't give protection, I don't think. Let's try this instead. Cancel this and just go here. Uh, not enough. 59 banners, I'll take it. It's not terrible. Good enough just to be able to make through we make sure we get through them. And then here we'll pull in some good Jedi going here. I'm thinking about maybe not even undersizing here and just throwing in a tank too so we get that pre-taunt going just to keep them off of them. I think we'll go this route. Like I said, I'm not necessarily worried about banners right now. I just want the win, especially since we've got that. All right. And let's push this over to Anakin. Let's get Anakin over here. Padme. So weird team that he's got here because he's got rebels mixed with Galactic Republic and she doesn't do anything for uh, the rebels, which is uh, not really understanding why he put them in the way that he did. But, I mean, hey. You gotta make up teams when you're at the lower levels to get stuff to work. So 60 banners, I'll definitely take that. I think I probably could have got 61 pretty easy there. I had a just undersized, but... Like I said, wasn't necessarily a need here. It's like a pretty easy ship's team. I think we can uh, definitely undersize and make it through this. So I did, I've almost got my bug ships ready to go. I put them on defense this go around. He did make it through them. But I'm looking forward to getting a whole bugs team with these two galactic republic probably going to keep vader as well um and just have a solid uh offensive team because right now this little trick that i'm running it does okay but i'm getting pushed out by teams that have better offense in my arena shard and which is no fun having to fight just to get the two or three hundred crystals that i can get from that every day so I think uh, I think this team is going to be much better. Actually, let me do this because I always end up putting them in the wrong spot if I don't do this. I'm really curious if you guys watch this. <laughs> let me know in the comments below. Like, I'm really like I, I looked. A, I did a lot of reading on the subreddit today, uh, the Galaxy Hero subreddit just to kind of see what people thought of the event yesterday. And, uh, man, it just seems like a solid no across the board. Everybody was just so disappointed with it. And I'm, I definitely was. Like, it just, uh, one of those things where it had all this buildup and was just really wanting more out of that for sure. And they're actually doing better than me right now. I always get screwed with that stupid uh, move that uh, does the ability block and then it ruins my taunt from Hyena Bomber. Like, that's one of the reasons that I am ready to get bugs in as well. That way Hyena can be my second tank coming in. Don't have to worry about uh, getting ability blocked and really kind of getting hosed. I don't see a taunt on that guy. I don't understand why I'm forced to hit him. Kind of a hit right there. Oh well. 
Full clear, guys. Full clear. 56. Not very good on ship spanners. I've definitely done better than that. He had that. That defense kind of surprised me. I was ex wasn't expecting it to do as well as it did, as far as hitting me banners wise. But another win. 1387. Not my best score by no means, but still a win. Undefeated so far. Pretty psyched about that. I'm really hoping that somehow. And maybe I should be a little bit more banners wary, but uh, it would be really nice if I got a I got a feat to unlock. So completely cleared. All right, that's gonna knock me up there. I need to be a little bit more uh, feats oriented, but I did do all the undersize already. Um, some of these I just don't have the characters to do, like this young Han Solo, Vandor, Chewbacca, all that stuff. I don't have that kind of stuff to do. I don't have young Lando. Um, or Lando Calrissian. I think I actually do have Lando, uh, but I don't have young Han. I do have Han Solo, uh, but a lot of them just aren't ready to do Grand Arena yet, by no means. So some of those are for the people who've been around for quite a bit longer, for sure. But um, I will hit Kyber today, so <laughs> that's pretty sweet. So when I get the win officially, then that'll push me over to Kyber, and then uh, hopefully I can be able like I really would love to hit top 10 I'm not sure if that's gonna happen I seem to be uh, hovering around top 25 ish right now uh, so unless some people lose it's not really gonna gonna push me in there so but uh, thank you guys for watching uh, hope you've enjoyed the stream uh, look forward to a video coming this afternoon I'm gonna do some reactions to the galactic extension event um, and then just some thoughts on uh, CG as a whole right now like some mistakes I think that they're making and some things that I think that if they just made some minor tweaks, we could have a lot more fun content if we just hit some things that they already have done well in the past instead of making just a, kind of a bland event that's like a marquee event that they did right now. So, um, but anyway, I'll get more in depth in that in the next video. This is definitely a, uh, <laughs> it's just for a Grand Arena right now, but I hope you guys are kick and tell in your Grand Arenas. Uh, if you have some questions about Grand Arena, I do have some guides out on uh, some teams, Zetas, all that kind of stuff that's helpful out there. So be sure to check those out. Uh, if there's anything that I can help with you out specifically, leave a comment down below. Um, right now, I'm doing my best, and I think I, right now I've uh, responded to every comment that anybody's left. So uh, that's my goal is to be able to interact with you guys. So uh, if you got questions, let me know. I would love to help you out. So, uh, But have a blast out there on the holiday table, guys, and see you in the next video.